All right, I've got a very special bee to show you today. But before we do that, let's take a little look here at the habitat. It's a desert. It's mostly creosote bush and sage and wildflowers. Here's a close-up of a creosote bush. It's nice little yellow flowers on it. Okay, there's your telemacro of a creosote flower. Now, inside the fence, there's a whole another set of wild flowers and other types of plants, so... A lot of things to attract the bugs. Okay, now this is the area where I found the bee. And there's a lot of disturbed soil and soft soil and other wildflowers. So now let's take a look at the bee. All right, in this container, we have a special friend. How about unveiling us? Let's get real close here. Flashlight. Uh, yeah, we could use a little more light, I think. Whoa, whoa, we need a lid. Now let's get a close up here. Let's see how close we can get before he flies away. Yummy. Put your wings out so we can see your pretty red body. Yeah, I think we're going to have to get a real close shot if we want to ID this one. Oh, there was a shed your yeah, chance. Telemacro view, he's so big. He doesn't, it's hard to get them all in there. Well, that might be a good enough shot of the wings there. Get a measurement on them. And how about some close-ups here before he gets away? Really bright red. Probably a little cold, huh? Yeah. Right, there's a nice digging. shot of the abdomen. Looks like he's digging. Digging a hole, huh? I wonder why. Maybe he's cold once to get into the ground. Could be. Yeah, he's gonna go right underground. It looks like. There you go. Okay, we'll see you later.